G'day everyone, gonna have a look at the uh, new Nava LED strobe slash rotators that they've got out now. Uh, LED rotating beacon's been around for a long time now, but this is the new addition to the market. So if you have a look at the top of it, she's a strange looking shape. So we'll, uh, we'll have a look and see what it's all about. Now, when they mount them, they say that the flat face is to the front of the vehicle because this reduces drag. But dead said if you're worried about drag when you stick a rotating beacon on the top of your Hilux or your grader, then yeah, you're probably a different kind of cat anyway. Uh, these come in a few different versions. This is the um, standard version. So there's a tall, there's a short, and there's a low profile as well. The only difference is the amount of LED rings that they have in them, but they all operate the same way, all with the same base. While we're talking about bases, you can see on the box here they have a few different types. So standard flange base, single bolt, pole mount and magnetic, um, plus the flexible pole, but you don't see too many of those around. Uh, 10 to 30 volts, light sensor for day and night, plus they're class one approved, um, so good for you know, work, road work, civil works and, in, and mining as well. Um, we'll get it going, I'll just join the wire up here. There we go. So standard brightness, but they have selectable flash patterns. So if I just sit it down like that, there's an extra wire that you can join, put it on a momentary switch, and you can actually change the flash patterns. Go back the other way. Quad flash or quint flash, as they call it now. And then solid, which is a bit hard to see on a phone video. That's it, it's got sand matting holes as the old ones, so they'll take your old rotating beacon off, these ones will go straight on. Uh, seven year warranty. They say that the lens is polycarbonate, so virtually indestructible, but big stick or big rock versus rotating be beacon, big rock, big stick wins every time. So take that with a grain of salt. Apart from that, pretty well made unit. Just about replaces all the old halogen rotating beacons now.